Now, nine people have been killed in a recent attack on three Taraba communities by Cameroon-based bandit. Lawmaker Riku Kui Urengian, representing Osa South constituency, called for the federal government to deploy security personnel to the affected areas. He criticized the bandits for unabated attacks and cited daily killings of children. Urengian urged stakeholders to prioritize security over politics and commended the state governor for his concern. Over 500 people have been killed in Osa and its environment by bandits and terrorists in the last few years. Many have been displaced and are quartered in various IDP camps. The murderers come in from Cameroon via, via the bordered communities like Acha, Takumtu, and other boundary communities and launching these attacks on these vulnerable communities. Two weeks ago, nine people were massacred in Junwakida. The motive of the killers is to subjugate the people, exterminate them, and take over their lands. The victims are helpless villagers who live in harmless and cultivated farms. The State Police Command spokesperson Abdullah Osman reveals awareness of cross-border crimes from Cameroon and plans to deploy more officers to vulnerable communities. The governor, Agbo Kefers, has purchased crime fighting equipment for the state. Usai is one of the state main food producers, particularly grains and fruits. These killings have negatively affected food production and increased food shortage in the state. Ladies and gentlemen of the press, the bandits and the terrorists routinely launch natural attack against the hapless citizens. These killings have become the most systematic and organized onslaughts ever launched against a people in this country. I humbly request that the federal government without any further delay should domestically deploy the military to strategic location in Osa, with special consideration to Pamboyashi area of Kombo Ward, where five people were killed on their way from Fikyu to Pambo Pri a few days ago. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.